Hey, welcome everybody. In this video, we're gonna be taking a look at the Base L2 network, a layer two on Ethereum designed and basically funded by Coinbase, uh, built on the OP stack, uh, same as Optimism. It's very fast, very cheap. It's been getting very popular lately. A couple things I wanna point out is that I am not paid by Coinbase, not affiliated in any way with this. So this is just me looking at it and uh, kind of seeing what's going on right now and uh, looking at the future a little bit. So. Uh, we're going to hop into it. This is Coinbase's website here, base.org. Um, pretty nice looking website, as you guys can see. They're uh, trying to show you what you can build here. Games, NFTs, lending, DeFi, swaps, um, so social fi stuff. So uh, pretty nice website. We'll look at this stuff in a minute. Um, you got powered by OP Stack. Kind of gives you a run through here. Uh, but it, it's basically Coinbase's uh, L2, their scaling solution to your Ethereum's uh, congestion, Ethereum's cost problems and all that that kind of stuff. So um, I guess you can learn about how it's scaled with OP here, um, how they use the OP stack. I mean, same as Optimism. So um, what else do we have done here? You can see the community, some other things. Uh, let's see, they got their bridge here too, right? Yeah, so if you need to bridge your Ethereum or whatever you got over, you can do it here. Um, pretty simple process at their website. There are other bridges, and we'll look into that in just a second. Um, we'll look into the ecosystem too in a second. I want to show you guys their Twitter real quick in case you need to follow or get updates. It's at base on X on Twitter.com, X.com. And uh, they do have a gold check, so they're pretty easy to find. You could also just find it right here up top. So um, also have, uh, I'll, I'll point out the base explorer real quick. So basecan.org, you can. Um, come in here and, and see all the transactions and whatnot. If you need to say add um, Toshi, which is a meme coin, right, on on uh, base to your wallet, you could always come and get the contract address here or something like that or, or check it out. But um, it's pretty, pretty well thought out here, simple to use. So just know that that exists if you are gonna hop into base because it's probably gonna be important. Contract addresses are important. Of course, you can get that at CoinMarketCap, CoinGecko, stuff like that too to add to wallets. Um, but a lot of the times like MetaMask won't have those wallets or you just wanna see stuff on the scan. So there you go. So the ecosystem here, this is straight off base's, uh, base.org, base's website. You guys can browse through this a little more in depth, but you can see that they do have a lot of companies here working with them, integrated in one way or another, a bunch of bridges, right? I think even Wormhole. Axelar is helping with this stuff too. Oh, they might be interchain. Yeah, so there we go right there for those two. Gaming, we got some games. Yep, yep, yep. So they're getting into that. Social fight is pretty big. We're social. Here we go. Social. Okay. Some of these you may have friend.tech you probably heard of. Uh, Galaxy for sure. They're separate, but we're working with them apparently. So uh, DeFi, Bouncer, Base Swap. BP. Okay. And then uh, we got a bunch of DEXs too that we'll get into, but let's look at, uh, let's go to, go to this real quick. I want to show you guys these top gainers here and then I'm going to go to DeFi after that. This is kind of what sparked me looking into this. Um, well, I, I've been thinking about it for a while, but this kind of pushed me over the edge today to, to just jump in and do it. And this was about four, oh, five days ago, actually, when this was updated. So these may be a little bit different now, but swap based, swap based was uh, up 826%. So, um, and they're the base token. Uh, DGen is DGen token, of course. These are swaps. Um, we got a bunch of swaps near meme coin, game stuff like that. So, um, point being is is base base projects are getting warm, and I really think that uh, a lot of things are going to move on base soon. It might be one of our, or I don't know if it's going to be a long term narrative, short term, what like that, or, or something like that. But it, I do think base is going to start moving here. You can see it spiking. I know a lot of things are are starting to to go up. Uh, but base seems to be moving up, maybe a little more than most. Uh, let's see if we can, you know, if we zoom in to, to this year, it's not that high, but this is out about, uh, is this 20? Yeah, so this is almost a year out, so it's not really that compressed of a chart. Uh, let's see if we can throw some things over here real quick. Uh, fees are going up on it, so revenue's probably increasing, and those fees aren't from Ethereum going down or anything like that. It's just increased traffic, uh, or sorry, I meant Ethereum prices going up. Uh, they've actually gone down. So revenue's gone up quite a bit. Let's check out stable coins. Stable coins, uh, okay. Yeah, that's shot off quite a bit right there, huh? So people are moving finance over to base, which is a good sign. 
Uh, let's check out a few more here. Turn staple coins off. And then we'll go through some projects here. Hmm. Moving some off there. Um, let's check out volume real quick. Oh yeah, that's a pretty good increase in volume. Okay, so volume's increasing in TBL. It's not, I mean, the two are almost always correlated, but not always, so cool. Going down, we got some of their protocols here uh, ranked by TVL, total value locked, and total value locked, by the way, is almost 1 billion for um, base. Forgot to mention that earlier, which is pretty good. I think um, Arbitrum's 3 million. I think Arbitrum's the biggest right now. The other layer twos are right here at about 1 billion as well. So very competitive and very new. So they, they have shot right up there with the, uh, with the others. So, do we have here we've got aerodrome number one uniswap okay extra finance so a couple dexes we got some looks like leveraged is a farming uh, compound for lending we've got beefy a yield aggregator friend tech mentioned them earlier friend.tech i think that is a, like an exclusive messaging program or app overnight finance moonwell obviously lending more dexes sushi's also uh, supports base seamless stargate Okay, some real world asset stuff. All right, Cygnus Finance, reserve for indexes, uh, base swap. I do, have, we're gonna look at base swap too in a minute. Um, but you guys kinda get the point, right? Even pancake swaps getting in on base and, and they'd be silly not to. So uh, some of these get pretty small in value. We're gonna be looking at one, let's see if I can find it on here. Um, I think they're, now oh, we're way too low, where are we at? Wanted more in the 10 million range, 6 million, I think. Oh, here it is, Swapped Base. I'm gonna check out Swapped Base. They're newer decks. I've seen their base token around moving a lot, and I thought it was a meme coin, but uh, upon investigation, it's not. So we'll look at that. Uh, let's go over to uh, some of their top dexes here on base. So we've got Uniswap, looks like number one, Aerodrome. So this is pretty much mimicking what we just saw right here. As far as the top, although they have Aerodrome as number one, um, yeah, who knows? Uh, Uniswap is divided here into uh, version two and three, so maybe that accounts for some of it. I don't know, but those are those are those numbers are much bigger. So I'm not sure how they're actually if these are aggregated to base or just total or what. Uh, but this is by trading volume anyway. That was by market cap or uh, total value locked. So. We do have a couple different uh, metrics here that we're measuring by. Just keep that in mind. I didn't even notice that until I was looking at it. Um, Pancake swap, base swap, sushi swap, swap base is right up there though. Uh, Daki swap, rocket swap. Yeah, rocket rocket swap. I think is multi-chain swap if I remember right. Anyway, so yeah, we got a bunch here. We'll check them out. We'll do it right now, actually. So we got this is base swap. Now I, I've base swap is. Let's go back here real quick. Number five here on their list. I think they only support base. It would make sense given the name, right? Eight, eight million uh, trading volume in the last 24 hours. All right. Uh, looks like the volume's gone down a little bit here, but that's okay. That's that's no problem. That just happens day to day. So um, I've used base swap pretty easy to, to swap things here. You just, you know, you got ETH or whatever you're trading with, you swap it for, uh, I guess, Brett, or maybe you want some, was that Boge? Doge on base, base Doge or whatever. So we got that. Um, it's Of course, it's not all meme coins. You could get some die, you can get stable coins, you can get uh, whatever you want here. They, they've got a pretty decent selection. It's not the biggest, but it's decent. Most of the stuff that you're probably gonna go for. They've also got liquidity here. They've got uh, for liquidity pools, you can farm liquidity or yield. Uh, you can stake stuff. You can get so they've they've got a three token set up here too. They've got BSwap, BSX, and XBX. And I I, I am not fairly sure how all these work. Um, one I think is deflationary. They burn it maybe. Uh, I think that's XBSX. I'm not sure but you can get like boosts and stuff here. So I might come into uh, come into a point where I wanna make a video on base swap. I'm not sure yet. I, I need to see it a little bit further, see if I actually wanna do that. But just know it is here, you can do all that stuff. You can stake, you can yield. Um, yeah, 
pretty standard decks. These, these are all going to be pretty standard decks, is to be honest. Uh, Uniswap the same. We can actually just go there right now. I was actually going to skip that one, but I'll, I'll show you guys. It's, it's super simple. It's just the Uniswap website. You just select base right here when you come into it. And then you select whatever token you want. So you're not going to get that big of a list as compared to, say, maybe the Ethereum mainnet, but there's still a decent amount on here. So it's something you can start with. And, and all the meme coins, all the big coins that you want are probably here. Everything you need is probably going to be here for right now. And as, as base grows, these will grow too. So here's swapped base. This one's newer to me. Um, I'm not sure why that's... Let's get this going here. Oh, it's trying to get my core wallet is why. Um, and we'll deal with that later. So I don't need to actually swap anything for this video. So um, more of a... was this like a regular Nintendo, I guess, kind of feel. Graphics. Which is, that's the cool style, I guess. Um, but anyway, they're, they're, they got everything here. Um, so if you want to trade, you can swap. If you want to do perpetual, as you can. They've got liquidity um, providing. They've got yield farm, all that good stuff, right? So uh, I'm not sure what this lottery is. I'll check that out in a second, but let's see what they got. So this is where the, the base token comes into play. And they do, they have some more unique coins here. I thought there were a few more at the bottom. I guess not. Um, so you kind of you kind of have to go between these dexes to really find some of the coins you want and find the liquidity you want. Uh, these have some, I don't even know what, Tomboshi or something, um, Toshi. So um, check it out. <laughs> Brian is bald, Coinbase is based. <laughs> there's, a, there's a new coin for you. Uh, so this is the one I just found though. So check it out, proceed with caution of course, uh, but looks like they're newer in the uh, the whole the whole base uh, dex game here. So uh, just know that people are building. Uh, go from there, right? So we got Coinbase Wallet, which works here. Uh, Made a mask, all these other ones. Um, and this is all from DeFiPrime.com uh, slash base. I'm just looking at base stuff here. So Aave Compound, just, just kind of a look at the ecosystem, right? So pretty much your standard coins that you got here, your standard wallets. Um, yeah. All right, so this is, uh, I wanna look at some trending stuff now that's on base. And I really do think some of these memes, uh, let's see that we're looking at here. I won't pull them up actually, but you had Toshi, you had the base god, TYBG or whatever it is. Um, B ship, base ship, base to Doge or Doge on base, whatever. I think these just with the, the super cheapness of base now and the popularity that we're seeing, I think we're going to see probably a lot of meme coins pop up here. So I don't know, maybe getting on some of these memes will be payoff for you guys. Maybe it won't. I, I can't say that. I can't make that decision for you, but maybe I, I do really think that they're going to pop. Uh, along with BNB and possibly Injective too, but I really think that that Binance or um, Base here is is pushing for for that, and I think it's going to happen. So um, we mentioned it earlier, but Friend.Tech, so looks like it is for messaging, exclusive messaging, you get keys or something like that. Uh, the Base Name Service, Friend Pet, I'm not even sure what that is. Looks like a game. Got Base Swap, Base Paint. That, that's an interesting one there. Uh, hmm. So we got all sorts of stuff, some finance. So base is, base is getting pretty popular. It's got a decent, no pun intended, but a decent base started. And I think it I think it might be going places here really soon. And, and you know, looking just looking at that chart on DeFi Llama, right? It's it's already it's already going there. Oops, it didn't. And we're already shooting up. When did this start? In February, right? Yeah, February 25th, we started skyrocketing. And we haven't stopped. Like even the downtrend in Bitcoin hasn't stopped this. It shot right up. Let's look at let's look at something real quick before I go to that chart that I just had or that uh, list. Let's check out optimism. So look at optimism's even had a downtrend here, right? So this is basically about when Coinbase's base started shooting up. So everything was going up, and then these came down. Let's look at Polygon and see if the same thing happened. Where whereas base just went straight up. So it's like base is unaffected by Bitcoin right now. And of course, when you do these live uh, websites, never load right. Uh, we'll check out Blast. Okay, so Blast is Blast is brand new. Blast is kind of a hard one to compare to. Uh, let's zoom in here so we can actually make sense of this. Uh, yeah, so even, um, yeah, so we started right here with that, that uptrend in, in base. And same thing mimicked here as in Optimism, uh, a drop. But base, 
base just shot right through that, went straight up. Unaffected, see, right here. I mean, maybe it may be level for a minute, but didn't go down really, just shot up. So base has some strength behind it. I really do think that memes, I think that projects here are gonna get hot. And I think that uh, people are gonna make a lot of money on base. You know, we'll see what the future holds, but I, I feel like that's coming. I feel like there's so much money put into base, so many projects, so much backing by Coinbase that they won't let it fail. And uh, it might be highly, I don't even know if it's highly centralized right now, but they do plan to decentralize it further as we go. And I, I do think that Coinbase will do that. Um, if they don't, I think they're going to lose a lot of trust in a lot of people. So just look in here. This is um, just, just to close out here. Top base ecosystem tokens by market cap. So uh, we got Axlar. Axlar is big on interoperability. I think Coinbase backed them too. They're a, a Cosmos SDK chain, uh, IBC enabled. So really, really big uh, deal that they're reaching out and working with Coinbase. So you can move your um, base slash Ethereum stuff over to the IBC and vice versa, uh, be that USDC or actual ETH or whatever you want to bring over. Axelar is really, really big. I think them and uh, Polymer are going to be huge in, in that aspect for base. Uh, who else we got here? Toshi. Yeah, we got a meme coin. Let's look at this chart on the meme coin here. We've got Brett. We'll look at a couple meme coins just because it's, why not? It's fun. Um, we'll get base. We'll just call that now for good. Good for now, I mean. So yeah, look at this. Look at these charts. These are insane. Um, yeah, this one's been around for a little bit, but look right around here. Right when base started getting popular, boom, just shot up through the roof. That's crazy. Of course, these are meme coins, so keep that in mind, guys. I don't uh, recommend you buy meme coins. I don't recommend you don't either. You do whatever you want. I don't own meme, co meme coins. I do follow them. They're interesting and they're fun to me, but um, I don't I don't invest in them, I should say. I've certainly bought them for videos that I've made for you guys for fun. Um, again, Brett's doing okay again. Not, not as strong as Toshi, but I think Toshi is actually um, supposedly Brian Ar Armstrong's cat, the CEO of uh, Coinbase. So the base gods doing actually really good. Um, and this is a meme coin, a Brian Armstrong themed meme coin actually. So good for them. Here's uh, swap, swap base, uh, swap based. Uh, this is their uh, coin. Got pretty hot. It's cooled down a little bit. That's all right. Um, probably with Bitcoin there, I'd bet. Bitcoin dropped a bit here, so alts tend to get pulled down with that. Uh, but man, that got hot quick. Went from a whole lot of zeros to a whole lot less zeros there. <laughs> I'm not going to read that number because it's, it's a lot. But base is doing pretty well. So, And that's that small swap. I don't know a whole lot about these guys. Uh, make sure you vet them yourselves. I mean, the market cap's hard to find here. Circulating supply is not there. Those are all uh, worrisome to me. So not to say that that's not a good project, just something you, you'd want to know before you really jump into it. So... Anyway, you guys can see here, there's a lot, of, a lot of green, right? A lot of green in this. And these are not all the projects. This is just coin market caps. Ran, I, don't, I don't know if a bot puts these together, human does or what, but um, still, it shows, it shows a, oh, look at base swap, pull that one up. It shows a, a lot of good uh, growth here in the ecosystem. So let's zoom out a little bit here. All right, so they were flat for a while, but now they've, they've started moving again, base swap, so. So there's base swap, remember, this is the bigger one. And then there's swap base, <clears throat> excuse me, swap based. So base swap and swap based. Base swap, the Viking one being the bigger one here. So um, yeah, anyway, make sure you guys do your research on all these projects before you jump in. Again, I'm not seeing much of a market, market cap here or anything. I don't know if that's a bug right now, a coin market cap or not, but be careful um, when you invest in these. Um, do your research, that's all you need to do. That's all I need to tell you. You guys can figure the rest out, right? So I'll keep you up to date though with videos, updates, um, you know, price movement, whatever on this stuff. Uh, if, if memes and everything starts getting hot here, I would watch base. And I think maybe those get hot because other projects get hot or maybe vice versa. Maybe the memes get hot and people <laughs> come over because they see all the traction growing from memes. I don't know. Either way, I think base is gonna get popular. It clearly has been already. It, it defied the Bitcoin dip. TVL kept going up when all the other L2s went down. So. It's got a lot going for it. It's got Coinbase back in it, which is huge money. Um, some of the biggest money in crypto, right? And it's got more backers than that, most likely. So I think you guys should watch out for it. And I don't know, maybe make some money off it. We'll see. Anyway, if you guys can hit the thumbs up down below, I'd appreciate it. Um, like and subscribe does help the channel out. And that's all I got for you till the next one. See ya.